right. How's everybody doing out there in the uh, online land? We're uh, coming to you from Central North Carolina. This is uh, the uh, home ground for Methods of Madness. And uh, we're going to take inside the studio here and uh, check out uh, what we got going on. So come on in. Kind of what we have here. We're starting recording the Guilty Sin album. Starting off, first of all, with scratch tracks. Basically, we're going to take some drum tracks, drum guitar tracks, drum bass tracks, and go back and then compile stuff to see, put it in here and stuff. So we knocked a couple of songs out of the way. Um, this is week one, episode one. Definitely want to stay in tune because there's going to be a lot of stuff happening and we want to keep you all up to date, get you excited about what's going on. How's it going, peeps? Um, I figured I would let you guys know a little bit about this next album. Ooh, shiny. Um, it is a concept album, meaning that for those who aren't familiar with the term concept album, Every song is a continuing chapter in the same story. It's all one big story, and all the songs are just different parts of the story. Some of the more famous albums are, uh, of course, Scenes from Memory by Dream Theater, 2112 by Raj, of course, Operation Mind Crime, so on and so forth. So it was an interesting challenge because we had to write songs to pre-existing story and we knew we had things that we needed to say and tell them the story. So it was tough in that aspect, but at the same time a whole lot of fun and it gave us an interesting approach to the album, which is always something cool when you can get a new approach to writing or performing or recording and so on and so forth. We just thought it would be really cool to come on and do these madness sodes, so to speak, and let you guys see a little bit of stuff that comes behind the scenes and the making of and keeping track of it. And of course, you know, for our own fun to be able to look back, you know, 20 years from now and go, oh yeah, you know, look at what we did. Plus, we're we're big music geeks. We love watching that kind of stuff with all of our favorite bands. So, um, hoping there's somebody out there that would, you know, be curious about our stuff as well. So, look forward to it in the coming weeks. Uh, we will be bringing you more and check in for part two next week.